There's also quite a few footer customization options that you can use. And I'm just gonna show you those quickly. So if I go to footer here, the first is layout. So there's a whole bunch of options that we've got in here. So can you see I've chosen a quarter, a quarter and a half with three widget errors. Uh, but you can change this so I could go a half, a quarter and a quarter and you'll see how that first one now about us is a half, second two a quarter quarters. Uh, or you can just do two columns. So loads and loads of controls in terms of changing the layout of your uh, footer widget areas or you can just have one long column. Okay, so uh, hopefully it's very intuitive and I think it looks great. There we go. Um, the other thing that you can do is you can change this custom footer text down here. So uh, if you want to get rid of the default sort of storefront design by WooThemes text, you can just pop in your own text here. You can also put HTML in here as well. Like say, so I've just changed that text down there. Uh, the other thing that you can do in here is you can change this, these uh, widgets size. So for example, if you want to change the text size, you've just got this color here. And see how that's getting bigger. This is the header text size up here. So this will change this one here. And if you want to make them up, okay. So again, full control over the fonts and the font sizes within your widget areas. You can also change the text color, the link color and also the bullet color in here. So that's how you can customize the uh, footer on WooThemes storefront.